a potential new treatment is offering some promise tonight for those with type 1 diabetes. Ashley Eddy looks into the method that could be life-changing for so many people. 1.6 million. That's how many people researchers say suffer from type 1 diabetes. Insulin shots is the only, uh, so far it has been the only treatment approach for these individuals, even though it is not perfect. And it's especially not perfect, they say, for brittle diabetics, those suffering from a more severe form of diabetes. But husband and wife duo, University of Missouri School of Medicine researchers, Dr. Haval Sherwin and Dr. Esma Yoku, say they're looking to change that. We could take pancreas from a diseased individual, prepare those cells, what we call islets, that make insulin, and those islets can be infused into an individual who suffers from this brittle diabetes. But this treatment still needs work. Sherwin says transplant patients need to take lifelong medicine to control rejection. But these drugs aren't always effective and there can be major side effects. So Sherwin says for the last 20 years, they've been trying to research an approach that could trick the immune system to recognize the life-saving cells as something not harmful, but rather helpful. These two proteins simply, we use them as a tool to deliver two different signals to the immune system to tell immune system that this is something useful. 